Ann Feldman here from TT for T. Do you have WMV files that you have created on your Windows machine that no longer play on your Mac? Well, Flip for Mac is the solution for you. It is a free download from the Telestream.net website. This video will show you how to download the video, install it, and then use it on your computer. First, go to Telestream.net, Flip for Mac, the website and click on download now. That will download the free player onto your computer and you will find it down on the bottom left hand corner of your screen as it will come on down. Now for our computers that we would like you will need to use the version Flip for Mac 3.0 that's compatible with Lion. So you just click on download now and follow the on-screen prompts that prompt you along. You will see that file appear down in the bottom left hand corner of your screen and it will let you know how much download time that you have. So you can see this one's going to take me about six minutes to download. Once the file has downloaded it will appear here in the bottom left corner of your screen then all you need to do is click on open and that will open up the Flip for Mac software that you downloaded and then you'll be able to work with that file here in just a minute because we'll want to put that into your applications and you may even want to put it down here at the bottom of your screen in your dock if it's something that you're going to use often. So once that downloads it'll say that it's verifying and then it'll open up that file on your computer. Now once it's in here you can always check your files that have been downloaded a couple different ways. One of my favorite ways is to find it in your finder. That's a very easy way to find it. So if I go down to my dock and I look for the little happy finder guy and click on it, I'll be able to um, see my file. It may also just pop up for you, in which case you can just find it there um, where it has been up on your screen. So then for my case here, we'll just go Windows Media Installer, just go ahead and double click and that will install my Flip for Mac package on my computer. I'm also going to want to install the Silverlight from Microsoft too. That one's helpful. You'll need that if you use sites such as Tagzito, for example. It will ask you to have the Microsoft Silverlight installed. So go ahead and just double click on that. It will start installing then again on your computer. You just need to follow the on-screen prompts. One of the things that it may ask you as you continue through all of these prompts is um, that you'll need to also put in your password for your computer. So when you install, install things, you just continue, 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 agree to everything that you see, and then once you click on that install button, it may ask you to type in that password on your computer. So I'll put in my secret code, install that software, and then away it goes. After a couple of minutes, your installation will be successful and complete at which point you can go ahead and close that installation package. And then if you click on your finder, you will be able to find that software and where it's been installed. So that Flip for Mac software um, will be sitting there in your applications folder. And then from there, you will be able to run your Flip player and um, view those WMV files. Now one thing you may want to do is you can take that little icon and you can drag it down to your dock and plop it on your dock and then you'll have it there at your fingertips if you need it there as well. It should automatic automatically recognize the WMV files and so it should just auto play and auto start when you click on those WMV files. You may need to say open with and in which case you would choose flip for Mac and then those video files will open. So happy watching videos that were created on your Windows machine on your Mac computer.